Along the East Coast are preparing for the worst of Hurricane Florence. Indiana's Task Force One is headed into the storm. Emily Kinzer is here, and Emily, you talked to the team who just left this morning, right? Yeah, Nina, I did. They actually left just before 4 this morning. They just got the call around midnight that they were getting deployed. That call from FEMA. Now the 86-person team is driving through the night to get to North Carolina. They don't know just yet where their final destination will be and exactly what job they'll be doing, but they're prepared for anything. They're what's called a full type 1 team, so that means they can do a number of jobs from helping with structural collapse, canine search, and water rescue. The same team was also heavily involved with the relief efforts of 9-11. 17 years ago, uh, this team traveled to New York City uh, early in the morning uh, of September 11th, and uh, some of the same members going out the door today uh, went on that same response. Pruitt says with them being deployed on the 9-11 anniversary, it's something that's weighing on their minds as they go to help with what could end up being a very big natural disaster. And right now they don't know exactly how long they'll be helping there. Of course, we're going to be staying on top of this. We'll follow along with them, let you know what they're doing, how they're helping, and bring that local angle to you uh, here on the Indiana side. Emily, thanks. We'll certainly track their progress. 630